Hey everyone! My name is Sarah Johnson and I am a pediatric occupational therapist, a CLC, and part of the infant development team here at Emerge Pediatric Therapy. I am here today to talk to you about three environmental adaptations that you can do for your infant if they have torticollis or a suspected head term preference. The first thing I want to talk about is if your infant is demonstrating a tilt to one side or a consistent head term preference to the other side, it's really important that you seek out an occupational therapy or physical therapy evaluation to look at the torticollis in depth. While these strategies will help, if there is a term preference, it's really important that you get individualized care for your infant. So when we're talking about torticollis, infants typically demonstrate a term preference to one side. When infants have that term preference to one side, we tend to see it across all of the things they engage with throughout their day. There are three different ways that we can work on your infant turning to the non-preferred side. So if your infant always looks to the left-hand side, we are gonna think about targeting activities on the right-hand side. And if they're always looking to the right-hand side, we're targeting things on the left-hand side. The first thing I wanna look at is how you put your infant down in a crib. A lot of times we have a specific way that we lay an infant down and they're always facing the same direction. When you think about their position in the crib, they might always be turning in one direction to see you when you enter the room. One strategy you can do is to lay your infant down to the opposite side to encourage turning in the opposite direction, or you can switch the way you lay them down each time they go for a nap or for sleeping at night. That way you'll be encouraging them to turn in both directions and help a little bit with that preference. The second thing I'd like to look at is where does an infant look when they're in the car? Are they sitting and looking out the window to the right hand side, the left hand side? Are they looking at a sibling? Whatever direction they're looking at, try to find something to turn their focus the other way. So if they're looking at the window out of the right side, try switching their car seat to the other side, and then they'll have to look out the window to the left side. This can work the same for siblings. Um, and another way you can encourage this is to put some toys on the window if you're unable to move the car seat to the opposite side to have something that can attract their attention to that opposite side. And finally, we can work with infants on encouraging them to turn their head to a different side with our toy placement. So if your infant is on their tummy, and their preference is to look towards the left-hand side, we are gonna to put toys all on the right-hand side. If they are on their back and their preference is to look to the right-hand side, we're gonna put all of those toys on the left-hand side so they're having to turn in the opposite direction. This can also work for sitting as well if your infant is at the point that they're sitting. Remember, whatever side they're looking towards, try to put the toys on the opposite side. I hope you enjoyed these three environmental adaptations that you can use to support your infant's development at home, specifically if they have a term preference or torticollis. If you have any questions regarding torticollis or infant development in general, please feel free to reach out and we'd be more than happy to help you. Thanks so much.